Hello everybody, it's Red Panda Gamer here for a really exciting video that I really didn't expect to, to do, but I'm sure you already know what it is by the title, even though I'm trying to make it a surprise right now. Um, I got access to the Destiny First Look Alpha, and I'm super excited about it because Destiny is actually a game I'm pretty excited for. And with E3 having just passed, you know, this is one of the games a lot of people are talking about, and uh, they allowed access to apply for the Alpha, I believe, the, the after the first day of the show, like after they did their thing with Sony, I think they announced Alpha. Um, and I think the beta doesn't start till like July or August, so I'm pretty excited that I got to try it now. Uh, I'm a pretty big fan of Bungie. Like, I really like the Halo games that they made. I'm not as big a fan of the newer Halo games, just because I feel like they feel much more like standard military shooters rather than like sci-fi games that let you jump around and be goofy and stuff. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and just show, I'm gonna create a second character. Cause I think what my plan is, I'm gonna do a video of each character or do something with each character. So I played as a Titan before and there are armored engines of war. Control any battle with strength and a strategy. So they have some special abilities that they can do. Um, each of them has something individual and then the hunter you are a master of the frontier stalk and kill your enemies with ruthless precision They can summon a flaming pistol. That sounds really cool. And then warlock space wizard the universe bends to your will manipulate its Energies to annihilate your foes. So I already played as the Titan once they're really just standard first-person shooter style uh, He's got like an assault rifle and a shotgun, but there was nothing really special about it So I'm gonna go ahead and play as hunter uh, and I might also play a little bit as the Space Warlock, Space Wizard guy. Um, so we have three different races. We have the Humans, which look like humans. We have the Awoken, which look like humans with blue faces and crazy eyes. And then we have the Exos, who have robot faces. And they have really cool glowy eyes. They look like Daft Punk robots. What does a female Exo look like? Aww, so pretty. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and be a human, I guess. Oh, cool. So it's completely random. Um, that way I can mess with some other stuff. So we have different faces here. I'm sure like the f the, the final release of the game will give more customization for this stuff. Um, but for now, it's pretty simple. And like I said, this is an alpha. Like, I want to make sure that is understood. Um, I guess we'll just kind of... Whoa, like, that's like more of a greenish color. Okay. Actually, you know what? No, I want to be an EXO. I mean, I, like I said, I don't think it really matters. Um, I just like that the EXOs have, like, cooler skin colors. Like, you can make him blue. We can make him, like, the Flash. So we can make him red. This is what I did before. Make him red. And then we can give him, like, these things. No, not that. What was that I gave him before? No, not that thing. Oh, was it this? Yeah, give him those. Make him yellow. He's like the Flash now, uh, but whatever. None of that stuff matters because it's all uh, helmets over all of it. So yeah, this is the alpha. I just gained access to it. That is basically just explaining Bungie saying, we love you, thank you for playing. But I think it's ironic that I stopped liking Halo games because they started being made by 343 and they felt more like standard military shooters. And now Bungie has gone to Activision, the king of you know generic uh, military shooters with Call of Duty. Um, but this game doesn't really feel like it has much influence at all from Activision. I mean, we'll see once it comes out, but for right now, it feels pretty straightforward. So, oh, this is a completely Sky different mission than what I did before, steps. I think. And it's surrounded by fallen. Oh no, this is the same well, thing, but the I'm last time I played are. it, this looked completely different. Wow. Uh, yeah, when I did this before, oh, also I had the same exact gear. I wonder if it, oh shit, I shouldn't have thrown that grenade. I meant to do this. I don't really know what's different about my character. I mean, I guess I'll have different abilities and stuff. Wow, this skybox looks so pretty. The previous time I came here, it was like more like summery looking. It was much like more yellow and red sky, but this is so pretty, much prettier. Um, okay, so yeah, I'm playing this on the PlayStation 4. I guess that's important to note. Uh, we have this little guy right here. It'll tell us what to do. I don't remember his name right now. Um, but he's got a nice British accent. He kind of reminds me of, uh, is his name Atlas? Whatever the guy from uh, Portal 2 is, the guy who follows you around. It's been a while since I've played, so I don't really remember. Um, so in this game, like, the, at first glance, the game has, like, some feel 
very akin to Borderlands 2 or Borderlands in general. Like you have like the numbers that pop up. Uh, you have a level system. You have actually a lot of this game is, reminds me a lot of uh, Borderlands 2, which is fine. I mean, Borderlands 2 is a good game. Um, we can go down here, but we don't want to. So if we come down here, uh, this is old Russia, by the way. I don't know if you saw that, but I thought that was kind of cool. Oh, wow, my controller lit up. Uh, down here, we'll run into some enemies that I can't actually fight. So there are, I don't even know what level they are. I don't know what they're about. Um, but I can't mess with them, so I'm going to run away. I think, oh shit, I went the wrong way. I think they ran off. They scared me. Uh, this way. So yeah, we're in old Russia, in case the, you know, the language wasn't obvious enough on the walls and stuff. Um, something weird about this alpha, and I don't know if this is something they're going to do for the full game, at least I hope not, but, like, enemies kind of res not respawn, but they just kind of come back, which I thought was kind of strange. Um, but now I don't see them. But the radar is saying there's enemies over here, which I don't believe, because I don't see any. Unless they just mean below me, which I'm going to assume that's what they mean. Um, we can also spawn a vehicle by pushing this down and then pushing square. And we get this cool motorbike thing. It has like a, a speed boost to it. It's pretty cool that you can kind of just summon that out of the blue. And I imagine that means we'll be able to summon more cool stuff from time to time. Yeah, this game looks really pretty though. Like I, I like the visual style. It's, you know, it's no surprise that this game is made by the people who made Halo. But it's still kind of preserves its own like originality like i wouldn't a big part of me wants to just describe this as like halo combined with borderlands and it kind of is but it kind of has its own feel to it as well which is important um so that thing talking is oh that just stays i mean i guess i can summon it it's a sparrow um but at any time we can go back to orbit as well which is like our main hub um, but there's no reason really for us to do that now. I'm kind of, I'm very perplexed with the fact that this is a different, like it's the same level, but it looks very different. Like the skybox and all that, like the lighting. Um, so last time I did this, I kind of tried to be stealthier about it, but whatever. Also, my jetpack thing is different. So the other character I played as, the like main like assault class or whatever, he has like a jetpack jetpack, but this character feels like he just has a double jump. Which is interesting, I guess. So we just kind of have to take these guys down. Some of them are way higher level than me. So I'm going to throw a grenade. There was an invisible guy there. But I hit him anyway. Damn, dude, you're strong. Uh, but yeah, we have, like, regenerating health and all that stuff. Like, we have a shield that, you know, we can... So we can take a lot of damage before we actually need to worry about it. Um, but the enemies in the alpha are kind of dumb. Which is smart, because then you don't have people just dying over and over again. I mean, I died, like, I don't know three times because I was just trying to get a feel for how tough the game can be. Um, yeah, so we have a knife that we can use, but it's not killing them, which is really annoying. Okay, I got that one. And that elder vandal guy is crazy hard. And their guns are weird because they have like these curvy bullets that you can easily dodge. Let's take out my shotgun. Let's get all nice up and close. Close and personal with this guy. Maybe not, because that doesn't seem to be working very well. Oh, God. Oh, I didn't mean to throw a grenade. I do that a lot where I... He tried to duck because of the grenade. That was kind of funny. This guy is really strong, and I don't know why. I mean, he's a lot higher level than I am, but... I don't feel like that made much of a difference last time I fought him. Plus, if I got more headshots, that would probably... I'm going to have to turn down the volume on my TV because I'm sure you guys can hear the game. Stab him! I don't feel like stabbing him is doing anything. What the hell? Why is this guy so much stronger than me? I don't feel like I did anything differently the last time I did this. Like, I didn't have this much trouble with anybody. And the grenades take forever to... Re and I, I, that's another thing I like. Uh, the grenades, they recharge. Uh, they don't just, you know, you don't just instantly use grenades. Fuck you. Jeez. It's a crazy man. Um, but yeah, I got him. 
So yeah, the, the only difference really between this class and the other one is that I have a double jump instead of a jetpack. I have, it looks like I have different grenades, but they really just look like they're a different color. They don't seem like they do anything different. Um, and then I have a knife, and then I am imagining whatever like special I have will be different as well. I don't feel like this guy's any stronger, which I don't think he wasn't really supposed to be. He just seemed like he had a lot of different um, benefits. But yeah, as far as I know, there's no like backstabs or anything like, like silent takedowns or anything. Not yet, anyway. So we leveled up. I never got past hit level four when I was playing earlier. Which I don't know if you're really supposed to. Well, no, I mean, I know you can, but. Um, so I'm going to be doing two videos. I'm going to be doing one video covering all the single player stuff, uh, or at least as much as I can. And then I will be doing another video showing off the multiplayer mode that's available. And I played a little bit of the multiplayer, and it was it was fun. I mean, I am a fan of multiplayer games. Uh, oh, so let's go ahead and do this. Um, the weird thing about this game is, like, all of the UI stuff is controlled with a cursor that you use the left joystick for. As if it's like a mouse and keyboard, which I thought was kind of cool, but it almost kind of seems like a pain. And you can't use the trackpad on the PS4, which I feel like that's kind of a weird decision. Um, so this game has like actual armor sets that you can find in the game. So like almost like an RPG, um, which is kind of cool. And then I th it changes based on what you find, which I thought that was neat. And then uh, we can go ahead and upgrade. And uh, we get the golden gun. So I'm going to flaming pistol with... Uh, which disintegrates enemies with solar light. That's kind of cool. Um, we have a double jump and an uh, incendiary grenade. So those are the two things that are like exclusive to the gunslinger, or the hunter, I'm sorry. Um, so not that many things to make him different, but whatever, we won't worry about it. Uh, generalist shell, ghost shell. Born from the traveler, built of machinery and light the ghost is your companion okay so the ghost that's what that thing is what the hell the the sky bar the sky changed again weird i feel like i need to watch the sky maybe that's why it seemed like it was a different sky because i just didn't look before that's very possible um so we can go ahead and like summon our vehicle again if we want eh, it's just right up here so yeah i mean nothing too crazy visual wise like i'm not blown away necessarily compared to some games i've seen on next gen consoles but like i said it is alpha so i can't have too high of expectations for it yet um but i can't imagine i can't imagine they're gonna do that much different to it but what do i know about video game development Ooh! oh damn it i did not mean to throw a grenade <laughs> Shit! that was a complete accident I keep doing that where I mix up which button's grenade and which button is uh, the stab because I wanted to see if you could like backstab people and kill them, but I screwed up so I didn't get to see. Double jump's cool though. I mean the jetpack isn't that. I mean you can only like jet around for a little while, so you're not really getting that much bigger of a boost. Uh, let's just follow where they want us to go at this point. Oop, shit. And I wanted to wait till my grenade charged because I'm gonna want it right here, but whatever, we'll be fine. Um, so we get introduced to a new enemy in a second here. Uh, the guy that just kind of fell back. But now we're gonna start running into enemies who have their own shields. And this guy gave me a little bit of trouble before. What's, what's his name? Fallen Captain. So as far as I've seen, the game doesn't go very much into story. They just kind of give you a couple levels to play through. Uh, which is pretty much what I'm going to do. Uh, and if you get into the alpha yourself, I'd love it if you would tell me what you think of it in the comments below. Or if, you know, you're planning on pre-ordering the game or buying the game or if you want to get into the beta or if you got into the alpha. Just let's just have a nice little conversation about Destiny down below. Because, I'm, right. you know, I, I love indie games and I do a lot of indie games on my channel. But I love every now and again a good AAA game. And, you know, Bungie with Activision's money... Like, that's a pretty good match. This is the Lunar Complex. The Darkness Zone! Get in. Fallen um, so this is locked. This gate. I can get it open. Can I come up here? And I know the game, like, I thought the game was supposed to be more open. Like, that's the thing. Like, I remember when they first started talking about this game and showing it off, it seemed like this giant open world shooter. God, fucking damn it. I keep wasting grenades. And I'm on fire now. I didn't even, actually, I hit my controller on the table, so that wasn't even really my fault. Hmm. 
But yeah, you know, I get excited for AAA games every now and then. Um, like Far Cry 4, I'm pretty excited for that. And Destiny, I was excited for it too. But yeah, when they first kind of started talking about it, it sounded like this big, like, MMO, RPG style, like, first person shooter where there'd be hundreds of people playing at the same time. Oh my god! I mean, I kind of knew that was coming, but oh my god! So yeah, these are the hive people. I don't know what they're supposed to be or what they're about, but they're kind of jerks. They kind of remind me of the Flood a bit. Like, kind of trying to stick to the Halo idea. Uh, but they remind me of the Flood. I don't know what they're all about, you know, what they believe in or what they're supposed to be, but you know, they're kind of annoying. And they're kind of jerks. Should I use the shotgun? I've had, like, no luck with a shotgun before. Yeah, the enemies are pretty uh, forgiving. Like, they don't chase after you very long. There we go. So I'm supercharged now, which means I can use, like, my flame pistol thing or whatever. And I will use that in a second. I'm going to want to save it. Hmm. I don't know what that says. If you know what that says, let me know There's in the comments. Here. I don't speak you Russian. You see something floating in the air? You have to kill it. Oh god. I actually forgot about that for a minute there. So yeah, like I said, it's 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 similar to Borderlands. Like right now it just feels like a, a decent first person shooter. Which is fine. You know what I mean? Like whatever. I can't be mad about a first person shooter. Like that's what I kind of thought the game was going to be anyway. Uh, well, I mean I didn't. I didn't mess with that grenade. Um, but yeah, the game is kind of hyped up as this MMO first person shooter where you can like play with other people or you can play by yourself and, and I, you can play this with other people like when you die there's like the, this whole like you can respawn instantly or you can wait for someone to heal you but I am not playing with anyone else and I don't, there's no local multiplayer option and as far as I oh my god, yeah just stab them all, I got a Grimoire card, I don't know what that is but it's mine. So yeah, I, I don't know if, like, I'm assuming the alpha, you're kind of just stuck playing by yourself. I mean, unless you're playing, like, multiplayer, like, versus. Um, but as far as I've seen, I can only play this by myself. So that's kind of like the boss of this area. This wizard dude. Oh, God. I don't, I, last time I fought him in here, and I kept dying. I just want to fight the rest of these high rail things. So that I can just kind of focus. Yeah, the other class that I played as, he punched with his fist. Um, oh my god. Oh no. So I think the wizard casts like a slow spell on me or something. Which is super not cool. Like, I'm really not okay with it. But I should just kind of work my way over here. No! Yeah, the radar too. Like, I don't know if you guys have been paying attention to it at all, but radar in this game is kind of strange. Like... It just kind of senses where people are, where they're coming from. It doesn't full on like tell you, which is fine. Like I don't mind it not just saying straight up like, "Hey, here's where the enemy is," but it's kind of weird that it's just like a bar that fills up depending on what's where. Sometimes I end up in a situation where it's saying that there's an enemy like right on top of me, but I don't really see them. But that's okay. I think it's just me and this wizard man now. Oh no. Is that Herbie Ant? Jesus. Oh, Alright, so let's try using my supercharge ability. Oh, I get like a. That's kind of cool. Oh wow, that was wasted. Shit. I didn't realize it was like something I could only use a couple times. Oh no. Wait, did you come over here? Whoa! So yeah, there's like this crazy wizard man, and he's really a pain to deal with. Um, except he's being pretty easy right now. Shit, I missed. Him. No, I got him. Too. I mean, yeah, he just kind of floats around and like ah fireballs. Or, well, not really fireballs. If I was gonna like say there were any kind of element, I'd say electric. Oh god, he slowed me down. Fuck off. I don't know if there's like loot or anything around here either. Maybe I should look around. Because as soon as I killed this guy last time, a timer just started. And they're like, okay, we're going to get you out of there. And I'm like, wait, no, I'm looking around. Oh, actually, fuck. I just realized I should have just killed him. Because his shield was down. Oh, I really don't want to die. Shit, 
didn't mean to shoot. There we go. Cool beans. So yeah, mission end. Oh, I only have. I know I found something last time, but I don't remember where. Maybe it was up here. Thought we had them contained. Was it up here? The darkness. I don't know. I don't know. Oh well. It's not really that important. Oh wait, was it over here? Or is this where I came from? This level seems a lot bigger. Um, where is all this? Or is this where I came from? I'm confused. Whatever. We beat the level. Uh, old Russia is dumb Russia. I said it. Um, I don't know what glimmer is. I'm assuming that's some form of currency. I don't know. A throwing knife? Dude, I want a throwing knife. So we got 57 kills. We didn't die once, but we only got 10 precise kills, which doesn't feel very good. Uh, but yeah, you can tell by like the way that's laid out that you totally could have done that with a bunch of people. Which, like I said, I, I would love to play this with other people, and I feel like that's kind of how this game is designed. Um, so I can set a new destination. Uh, we get this cool map. Uh, we can go to the tower, which is the last city of Earth. Or we can go to the Crucible, which is where we do multiplayer. Uh, or I can go back to Old Russia, which, why the hell would I do that? Um, I haven't been to the tower, though. So I'm curious what that is. My guess is it's something that, that says social. I don't know. I should have read what that description was, but whatever. I like a surprise more than I like reading, especially. Look how pretty that looks. It's beautiful. And yeah, so I don't know if we get to like customize our ship or fly our, like, cause kind of what I, the promise that I was made or felt that I was made about what this game is, is like, you are a man on, or a woman or whatever you are. You are a person on in this world who can get on your ship and go anywhere else and there will also be other people everywhere else and you'll just kind of get to hang out and party and do whatever you want but i don't necessarily f see that like that i don't feel like that's gonna be what this game is i hope i'm wrong because it sounds awesome uh but i just don't feel like that's what we're gonna get and i worry about that but who knows i mean I don't feel like they explained what the game was very well to begin with, um, so. I mean, 83 last year, they showed, like, a bunch of people playing together, and I was like, yeah, I, I mean, I get that you can play with people, but I want to know more about, like, the online, you know, the interactivity uh, portion of it. You know, I want to know how integrated you'll be with other people. You know, I didn't know if it would be, like, Dark Souls, where people just kind of randomly show up, or if it would be, like, World of Warcraft, where... You're always just interacting with other people. But, I don't know. I mean, the alpha just kind of feels... Oh, look. See, here's people just hanging out. What up, people? I don't... Is that a ball? Are we playing with a ball? Okay. I, I jumped on it. I'm going to pop it. Can I run? All right. So, I don't really... Oh, man. That looks pretty cool. So... Cade Six, the mentor of new hunters, arriving in town. Uh, in the tower, can help you with some equipment. All right, so let's just go that way. So now I am kind of feeling more like this is an MMO. I mean, it still it doesn't feel as like uh, seamless as I wanted, but whatever. It's alpha. Oh, nice! I can slide. Wait, how do I? What? How do I? Why is this closed off? They made it sound like that's where they want me to go. Where do we go? Right? Doesn't it look like they want me to go this way? Or maybe I just can't because it's alpha. I just like sliding. Um, what's going on, people? Oh, this is who they're talking about. Oh, you look crazy. Uh, so we have different guns here. We have auto rifle, scout rifle, sniper rifle. I want a sniper rifle. Hand cannon. That sounds fun. Okay, so yeah, glimmer is currency. So we have a fusion rifle, but they have level requirements. These cooler weapons down here. Bummer. Stock refreshes in two hours. Um... 
So we can compare this stuff to our current weaponry. Hmm. <clears throat> let's, uh, let's trade out our shotgun. So this is like the exact same shotgun, but it's more powerful, I guess. Yeah, dude, I want this one. Let's get this one. Um, and then I guess we'll replace the auto. I mean, I just want to see what different weapons do, to be honest. The perfect close. I don't understand why this one's so much weaker. I guess it's not that much weaker. Oh, this would be... Okay, we'd have this instead of a shotgun. I see. Hmm. Weird. Um, the rate of fire is so much lower. I mean, yeah. Like, the rate of fire is lower, but it's got... Yeah, let's get this. Why not? Um, so does it automatically... Oh, no, I probably have to equip that stuff. So... Let's see. I mean, I just want to see what other weapons. Oh, wait, we already. What? Oh, we already have one of those. Don't we? I just bought another one. Whatever. They didn't make that very clear. Fusion rifle. I want to see what that does. Um, so I don't really feel like there's anything else to do around here. At least not right now. I can just slide around in third person. Oh, I can go this way. It's over here. Hello! Slide down the stairs. Wait. I just noticed that there's like a... What's this? Where do they want me to go? I know that they want me to come over here, but I can't. Is that a frowning tree? Looks like it. I don't get it. I, don't, I feel like I'm missing something, but... I can't get through here. And I don't know if it's because it's alpha or what. They, they make it seem like they want me to go over there. Oh, I'm dumb. I can just come down here, can't I? Aha! I figured it out, don't worry. Crucible handler. What do you need? Whoa, dude, you look cool. Oh, but I need crucible marks. I don't know what the hell that is, but okay. Lots of people dancing. I'm jealous. I wish someone would dance with me. Welcome, Guardian. Sure, I'll take the hunter's cash. The wire in these gloves has been tweaked to war grow warm when your knife pierces enemy hide. That's cool. I'll take the helmet. I mean, should I take anything else? Everything's pretty cheap right here. Not a fallen cloak. I want a cloak. I don't feel like I was. I didn't even. I don't even remember being wear, having worn a cloak. What is there any? I don't think there's any difference between those two. Chest armor is better. This helmet is better. I just grabbed. I got our helmet. So then there's also Vanguard stuff, but I can't wear that stuff anyway. Is that it? Is that all they wanted me to do? How about you? Oh, this is Warlock. I'm not a Warlock, so no thanks. Commander. And you have Titan stuff. Okay. I don't know if you can like mix and match or anything like that, but I mean, I, I, if you can, you can, I guess. So we can change our helmet. To... Oh, wait, I changed. I didn't change helmets. I'm an idiot. Get some new gauntlets. Get a new helmet. 
I just want to see if I don't feel like it's actually looking any different. Man, uh, why well, get a fucking red cape? I didn't know that. So what, oh man, did I do this in the wrong order? Like, do they want me to go get, like, buy guns now? I'm just trying to do whatever they want me to do so I can potentially go to something else. But I have a feeling all you can do is go to, like, old Russia again, which I don't necessarily want to. Yeah, so now they want me to go to the gunsmith. And I'm assuming they're going to give me a gun for free now. What do you need? Um... Hand cannon. Why not? And now they want me to equip it. Or do they? Yeah, they do. Alright. Hey, where's the hand cannon? I. whatever. Yes. Report to the ship, right, to check on your ship. Okay. So is this pretty much just them making me go through the moves? Go through the motions of like, hey, here's this cool customization stuff. Which, I mean, it is cool. I mean, I can't think of many first-person shooters that have stuff like that. So I'm not going to complain too much. Tower hangar. Oh, over here. At your service. Hey, buddy. Oh, I can buy different vehicles. But you have to have... Vanguard marks, which I don't know what those are. All my vehicles up there. Whoops. Yo, dog. Your ship is ready to fly. Then let's fly. What, what is that? What they want me to do now? Hmm. Yeah, I don't feel like there's anything else to do here, so let's go. I just want to go see, like, what the rest of these weapons are about. But then I guess we're done, because... Ah, it's kind of lame that the alpha is just one level, and it's kind of a dumb level. Not dumb. I mean, it's a little dumb. Not dumb. It's just short. It's a short little baby level. Um, yeah, there's nowhere else for me to go besides Earth and the Tower. So let's just go back to... Oh, shit, wait, there's other places I can go? I didn't know that. Or wait. Maybe there's not. So there's Little Level, Investigate, Reports of Hidden Power, Trapped in the Cosmodrome Array Stations. Oh. I didn't do this. Okay, so there are different missions. Cool. I apologize for being a cynical bastard about it. And maybe we'll get paired with other people? I don't know. I mean, it didn't seem to try to pair me up with other people. That ship looks real silly. Like, it looks like it's just held together by, like, nothing. Just thought. Alright, so... All right. Wait. This time we go wherever Have we, we want. been here? Nothing holding us back. Yeah, we've totally been here. The guardians have been planting beacons here to connect back to the tower. But, but see, yeah, it does look different, them. doesn't it? We can help the city. I'm already detecting a few. The, I, I'm almost positive this is the same mission we did before. Right? Is it? I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, what's in here? It's a cool little cave. But there's nothing to do in it, so whatever. 
Oh, those lens flares. So next gen. So let's see what this pulse rifle is all about. Nice. But it didn't kill him. Which... Oh, damn. That guy just like disintegrated into nothing. That's cool. I can get down with people disintegrating into nothing. Oh, wow. That was a terrible grenade throw. I mean, this definitely seems like it's doing more damage for us, which is good. I mean, the guns don't seem that crazy. I mean, the pulse rifle is pretty cool, but the other guns aren't all that crazy. Hmm. What is down here? Oh, whoa. I mean, this is different. I can't tell. It feels like, it feels the same. But just enough, like a different enough to where you feel like you're getting more levels to play. Oh, hello. Arbiter. Because you kind of look like the Arbiter. Or the Covenant in general. What's in here? Isn't this where the... No, this is, I guess, different. Maybe they're... Above me? Yeah, see, these guys I can't hurt, so fuck this. Oh no! My DualShock 4 battery is low. That's a whole nother concern. Shit, I don't know where to go. They didn't seem interested in murdering me that bad, so... I guess I just won't worry about it. See, like, this is what I'm talking about. Like, I don't know where the hell these guys just came from. They just kind of seemed like they spawned out of nowhere. It seems like that a lot of the time, actually. Alright, let's just get back to the mission at hand. <laughs> get it, because it pulled out something. What's this over here? Oh, wow. That's real bad. So what's over here? So I, I feel like this is a different thing. Oh, is this what they want me to go to? This thing? Get mission. No enemy in a thousand worlds is as fearsome as five miles of unknown terrain. Stand by for coded dispatch. Oh, shit. Like where the hell did like like you know what I mean? Like these guys seem like they come out of nowhere. Also, do they have, like, four arms? Not, like, four arms. Like, everyone has four arms. Enemy scouted. I don't understand what my mission is. Provide an accurate estimate of enemy power in the divide. Okay. So I guess now we're kind of doing more of, like, an open thing where there's just kind of missions strewed about, which I guess is cool. It. I don't feel like they're doing a very good job of being clear. Or maybe I'm just not paying enough attention because it's 2 in the morning. I don't know. Is that, is that like another mission right there then too? Like there's that weird like thing in the ground. Let's use Pulse Rival. What the? Oh, I thought I killed him. I thought that was just him on the ground. Would have been, would have been convenient. Yeah, disintegrate into nothing. Except for whatever that was. Glimmer, I believe, is what that was. So I guess we're going up here? Oops. Right into the wall. Or ceiling or whatever. Oh, blow that up. That looks explodable to me. 
Okay, I guess it's not. It's some bullshit. The AIs at least seem like they're trying to dodge you. They just don't seem like they're that good at it. Which is fair. Oh, okay. This is where I'm supposed to be. Whoa. Hmm. Where am I going? Seriously, is, is this where I'm supposed to go? Oh, hey, other people. Cool. I was wondering where other... So, uh, why, I'm confused. why are these people here? I mean, I'm happy to see them, but... I was up there, and nothing happened. Okay. So, now what? <laughs> oh, I'm just supposed to stay up here? Okay. Oh. Okay. I'm getting a lock on what's happening here. Oh, they're just throwing grenades? You guys are crazy. I don't know if this was what they were, like, expecting, but... Alright, so now we're, like, playing with a bunch of other random people. Which is kind of cool. Like I said, that's what I wanted. The seamless multiplayer that happens out of nowhere. Oh, damn, that guy got blowed up. Oh, God, I shouldn't be down here. So what now? Missions available. Oh, wait, let's see. So is there anything available like here? Over there, I guess. I'll play for a little bit longer. I'm just kind of trying to figure out what this whole like there being missions just around is about. Wait, okay, so I can't get to it over here. Oh, it's right here. What does it want? There is much to claim here. Clear the enemy, and New Monarchy will do the rest. Mission parameters encrypted. Okay, so they just want me to kill enemies. Simple enough. Punish the enemies for the light of the light. For committing forces against the Cosmodrome. Drome. But where are they? Hey, cool, I leveled up. I don't know why, but I did. Am I just supposed to be looking for enemies? Upgrade unlocked. Let's see. We get throwing knife! Cool beans. I don't know how to do it, but we got it. I really want to know how we throw knives. Oh. Okay. I can't pick it back up. So I just kind of do that instead of a, a melee? That's kind of strange. I wonder if it just kind of does it automatically. Oh god, that's an enemy right in front of me. Sorry, I'm like clicking that right in your ear. Very professional, I know. So let's just come over here and kill these dudes. And then we'll be done, probably. I don't know if this guy has been the same mission or what, but we'll just work together. Oh, we still only have 50%? Goodness. Let's try going down here, then. Oh, 
Oh, that's cool. I don't know if I'm supposed to go down there. Oh, well, we're going to find out. No. Not going to risk it. Hmm. So I guess we're just waiting for more enemies? That seems kind of lame. Maybe I should go looking for him. Hello! <laughs> cool. Oh, there's some more. Hello! See, I just wasn't looking in the right spot. And then I think, yeah, so there's this other thing too, like, so there's looting obviously in the game. Then you can also go to like these plant, like these spin metal leaves and take them for whatever that's worth. I don't really know what I'm supposed to do with it, but I imagine that's another one of those things that'll be revealed at some point. This skybox is beautiful. I'm such a sucker for lens flares or just general lighting effects. Like they almost always look so good. And I feel like that is something that a lot of developers are doing to try to make their games seem next-gen without actually being that impressive. Like, when I first turned on Battlefield 4, I'm like, oh my god, this skybox is beautiful. But then I was like, okay, maybe that's really all that's beautiful about it. Yeah, we did it. Okay. I don't need to I'll kill you, man. You, I already did the mission. But I'll do it anyway. So what else is there to do? Let's summon our vehicle. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I tried to jump like while on it. That's a little silly. Mission. Dead Orbit needs some help understanding what this area once offered humanity. Sending an encrypted request. <laughs> I don't know how we died, but okay. Computer analysis? What? Is this where they want me to go? Dead Orbit is looking for... Oh my god, it's more enemies. <laughs> yeah, so I'm not, I don't want to play much more of this because right now it just feels very like generic, like, hey, go do stuff. I mean, I really hope that that's not what this game is, like where you just go to like a big open field and like, hey, here's eight missions that are essentially the same thing, just you go different places. I mean, I really don't think that's what it would be. Like, because then that really feels like an MMO, which not in a good way. You know, we're an MMO, it's like, Go get 10 blades of grass from these 15 enemies, which I don't really understand my math in that example, but whatever. You know what I'm saying. Uh, I'll just do this last mission and then we'll call it a day. I thought this was right, just was. Oh. That's it? Okay, let's go. Really? Okay. <laughs> That's all you want me to do. Alright. I mean, this, you know, it all seems cool. I just don't want to do dumb little missions for an hour. Eh, I don't know. It's Destiny. It's the Alpha. It's alright. Mission. More missions. I just want to see where this leads to. Oh. Of course. <laughs> well, I guess this is a nice view to end it on. So, yeah. It's Alpha. It's Destiny. You know, I'm glad I got to share some stuff of it with you. Um, I wish I could have shown a little more, I guess. But whatever. I can't complain. 
Um, I'm happy to get to give it an early try. Completely missed with my knife. Uh, I'm glad I got to give it an early try. Uh, I'll probably be buying it. I mean, I just worry that the final version is going to be like this, but I know that that's probably not going to be the case. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found it insightful and informative. Oh. Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to go over in that island. Um, but yeah, I hope you found this video at least somewhat informative and interesting. Uh, if not, I apologize. But hey, if you're not the one that got into the alpha, I am. And I'm going to use the golden gun to... That was kind of cool, actually. Uh, God, I'm going to keep playing this. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Be sure to like the video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and comment below on any thoughts you have about Destiny or the Alpha or anything about, you know, new games in general. Uh, but yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye. It's, uh, I know I said I was going to go, but I just found out that there's a different type of mission I can do called the Devil's Lair. Um, and we do that with three people. Um, I guess I'll try this. I mean, it made it sound like I had to be level six, or maybe that's just the recommended level. Um, but I wanted to, you know, so what I was looking at is, so there's like different types of levels. So there's like a story level and there's an explore level. And this is called a strike level, um, which involves like you and other people like going in and going after what I assume is one person um, or one kind of like big enemy. Uh, so yeah, that makes me feel a little bit better after complaining so much about uh, the explore level. But it's an explore level, so I guess I get it. I didn't realize that though. Uh, but that's why I should pay more attention and not record these videos so late. Uh, so I'll go ahead and cut out for now until we get to that. And look, I'm the only one that's level five. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be holding them back. But yeah, I'll be back in a minute. The fallen will continue to claw at the walls of our city unless we strike them down. Beneath the ruins of the Cosmodrome, in the shadow of an old colony ship, we've located the House of Devil's Lair and the High Civitor, feeding them their strength. We must destroy this machine god and send their souls screaming back to hell. Okay, so there's that little bit of story there. Um, so we got this guy with us. I don't really know. Where'd the other guy go? Wait, did he already die? How did somebody already die? I'm confused by that, but okay. Uh, that concerns me, though, that somebody already died this quick. Ugh. I should probably not go too far without my, my partner in crime. So our whole goal is to kill, like, this soul keeper or whatever, which... Oh, wait, you're not dead. Or you just respond. That is also fun. Oh my god, it's another... Okay, so the thing we killed, like, at the end of the first mission is now just a random dude we fight in, like, the beginning of this one. And there's a captain, too? Good lord. Also, their shields look really silly. I just, I just need to point that out. Oh my god. I don't want him to heal. Okay, so they're just gonna go down there and go after him. That's fine. I got him right in his dumb head, you guys. Did you see that? This is pretty good. What's this? These look like lasers. Pretty I'm complex. really curious. I'll need time. Oh, he's hacking this? Okay. Oh, is he deactivating that stuff? All right, I just realized I turned my volume up too high again. Oh no, I don't wanna die. I died. Shit. Whoa! What the hell? Okay, so we're back, and I'm in a completely different place. What? That's weird. Um, I also didn't realize you need PlayStation Plus to do this, which I thought was weird. Um, I mean, I have it, so that's that's good. But yeah, they won't let you play this mission unless you have PlayStation Plus, which I'm. I guess my guess is that means that this will probably be it then for me. I mean, as far as like what they let me play the single player, that could be wrong. It would just make sense that they'd be like, okay, two missions for everybody. But then if you have PlayStation Plus, you can do a third mission. That's probably gonna be like a boss fight. At least I hope it is. 
Man, those Hive Knights are crazy. I don't want to fight with them. Ah, oh, damn it, I missed. I tried to throw a knife at him. Oh, God. Um, I'm trying to just focus on not dying at this point, but hopefully... This guy has so much health! Like, I feel like we're not doing anything against him. Yeah, I should switch guns. Oops. Oops. He keeps putting up that burn shield. Ooh. Just gonna keep hiding behind this truck. It's been doing me well enough so far. If you like fire, here's a fire grenade, you jerk. Part of me hopes this is the only thing we have to fight here, but... Yeah, hit him with a knife. Oh god, getting out of here. Maybe I should go for more headshots, that would probably help a lot. Is there another one now? Someone heal me, please. Oh, okay, never mind. Maybe I should stop using this gun. So what was that? What's over there? A sir what? Well, I guess the only reason it stopped last time. Oh, that's an enemy. I thought that that was like some kind of thing. Well, obviously it's some kind of thing. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Is this all we're doing is just fighting these guys? I, I really hope so. Ah, oh, shit. I interrupted reloading. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, God. This thing's a jerk. I mean, I can only assume that we're just all really under-leveled for this. Damn it! I have terrible aim with the knife. And I wish we could pick it back up, but it doesn't seem to work that easily. Oh god, hello, eyeball. Yeah! I blew up the eyeball, no one worry about it. Wait, do we still have to kill this guy? Jeez. Wait, is that another eyeball spawning? Better not be. I don't know if I can deal with that. I was just trying to hit people. What a bully. We got him! Yay! Oh my goodness. Are we not done? I thought that would be it. Do we have to go this way now? Oh my god, we have to start all over now. Uh, okay, so we're definitely not as high leveled as we should be for this. Obviously. Oh no. I mean, maybe if everyone works together, we could do it much, much quicker. Oh fuck. But like, these guys are level 6, and the Hive Knight is level 9. Yeah! Finally, God. At least every time. Finally! Alright, well. Yeah, I don't know how much damage that did. I couldn't see. Did we kill him? Woohoo! That seemed much quicker. I just love when they float off. It's very, very satisfying. Oh, shit. Damn it. Blow for blow. 400 blows. I just want to see what all this leads to. I know I keep saying that, but it's true. Oh no. 
I'm gonna die. Or maybe not. What's going on over there? Who was fighting these guys? Should I not? I feel like I shouldn't have done that. I feel like I just brought them over to us. I feel like I should switch guns, because I don't feel like I'm actually using this very well. Like, if I was getting consistent headshots, I'd feel a little better about it. Damn it! I tried to hit him in the head, but I missed with the knife. Goodness. There we go. There's some nice headshots. Beautiful. There. See, I feel like we get through them so much quicker when everyone actually tries. Guys, what are you doing? Let's go this way. Where's the other guy going? Whatever. Not my problem. Fight into the lair. Cut through the fallen and hide. I don't know where the other guy went. I guess it's not really. Might not have been helping anyway. Oh, this is where we. Okay, this is where we were last time. When the game, like, totally freaked out. What are you doing? That's not gonna help us, you ding dong. So yeah, this is, I guess they just kind of automatically had me join people who were already on their way to the mission. I don't know. Oh, but those knights are so annoying. Oh God. Thought our guy just died. <laughs> okay. See, this is much more exciting now. Like I, I'm, I, I am enjoying this part much more than I was the other. Like, especially the explorer. The explorer felt kind of lame. Wait, what? Did we? I feel like we ended up outside now. Maybe not. No. Oh shit. Oh god. You could totally revive me, I'm right next to you. So I don't know if that's how it works. I don't think it works like that. Oh, wait, yes it does. Yes! Thank you. Oh, it's a wizard. I, did I miss most of those shots just now? Should not have gone like head to head with this guy. I got a shield down though. I want to get some hits. Oh, fuck. I gotta get out of here. Wait, one of our guys died? I didn't even notice. Oh wow, good spot, buddy. Great spot to die. Ah, oh, Jesus. <laughs> Speaking of great places to die. Where's he going? 
Did he seriously just like abandon us? What an idiot. Oh wait, never mind. I don't know where the hell he is. Help me, I'm just a little ball. Great. The way out of here is sweet. Ghost. Go, ghost, go. Pretty complex. I'll need time. I like the voice actor for Ghost. God, there are so many enemies. Oh no. Just survive, please. Don't die. Please don't die. <laughs> That was cool, I guess. Seriously? Oh, didn't respond. All right. Oh, I did not even see this guy right in front of me. <laughs> kind of blended in with this environment. Not like on purpose, I just wasn't making attention. Oh my god, there are enemies everywhere. Jesus. Fuck. And I know I have my ability, I just didn't want to waste it. Ah, shit, I didn't mean to throw the knife. I meant to throw the grenade. Cool. Good job, everyone. Are we just waiting for him to do something? That's kind of what I assumed. Really? You've only done one? I'll work faster. Come on, man. This is just ridiculous. Oh my god, look at them all. Oh, did we both die? Oh no. Dude, revive me. Come on, man. Hello. There you go. Thank you. I meant to in the knife, not throw, but okay. Oh god. Fucking cheats. I guess it was a bad idea to go hand to hand with a guy that has four hands and a sword. Look out behind you, there's an invisible man. Wait, where'd he go? Maybe he didn't. Oh, there he is. Well, that's another one. Shit. Oh my god, go away. Such a pain. Did I get him? Uh. 
These sword guys are annoying. Oh god. Nice. As long as we work together, we'll be okay. I really should use my ability, huh? Ah, oh, damn it! I'm close, but just so you know, there's. Oh, I'm gonna waste it! Time. No! I finally decided to use it. There, I used it once. That was really sad. And I used it on like the easiest enemies to kill too. Shield down. I knifed him. I knifed a wizard. Who throws a knife at a wizard? A bad, bad man. There's another one. There's two of them. Two wizards. Oh my god, seriously, those shots, like, just follow you. I don't think I'm gonna get respawned. Or revived. But that's okay, I got 17 seconds. Oh, no? Okay. This guy's just running back and forth. Let's go. What? I can't believe they spawned me back all the way over here. I guess that's just how many enemies there are. I don't know. Didn't mean to do that. Fuck. Oh my god, that was just terrible. Just awful. But yeah, they're snipers, so that explains why we've been having so much trouble. Well, not really. Oh, we got him. Good. <laughs> I don't know how long I was able to respond, but it's what I get for not paying attention. Wait, where am I going right now? What am I doing? I'm back, you guys. Some reason I thought that I automatically got my grenades and stuff back, but clearly that's not the case. <laughs> yeah, it's more like it. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Hurry up, man. Good God, can't we just put all three of our ghosts on here to hurry it up?
I knifed him right in his dumb face. Or her dumb face. I don't I don't want to be gender specific. Doesn't really matter. Oh, can we go? Oh I guess not. Oh shit, son! Wait, what? Where? I don't want to die again. I'll go up here. I kind of just cannot believe how long this is taking. Like, this seems really absurd. Like, unless this is the whole thing. Like, if this is just what the mission is, then... I mean, that sucks, but okay. But if we still have more to do after this... I'm not gonna be very pleased about that. Oops. Oh, God. Oh god. Oh, this is the boss. This is like the final boss of the, or not, the final, the, the boss of this area. That's who this is that we're fighting right now. At least that's what I think. Wait, are they both dead? I think they're both dead. Or maybe not. Oh God, I ducked under his attack. It felt like that anyway. I don't know if I hit him with my knife, but I'm gonna pretend like I. Yeah, we did it! We can move now. Holy shit! God, that took forever. Okay, so we're in the Devil's Lair now, and it looks like we're still gonna have enemies to deal with. Wait, where'd they go? You guys coming? <laughs> Come on! Uh, more enemies. <laughs> I can't say I'm surprised. You guys. Now that I'm thinking about, there was a bunch of gear that I thought we only gained access to once we got to like level six, wasn't it? So maybe that would have made this a lot easier. Maybe not a lot easier, but less of a headache. Okay. We're not done still. Jesus. Oh, hey. The layer is up what? ahead under that colony ship just on the other side of all those devils. Oh my god. Uh, uh, where's our other guy? Did he leave? Did he leave the game? Son of a bitch. I can't believe that guy left us on our own. That really sucks. I don't think we have any chance at this now. I mean, it's cool to see like bigger enemies. That was something I was wondering. 
Oh wait, he is still here. He's still nowhere. At least I see his name. Whoa! Like, we have a bunch of captain. We have, like, every type of enemy to deal with. Oh, no. I would have bought a sniper rifle now. I mean, I thought I did. Got him anyway. I mean, this has been working fairly well. Oh no! Okay. Where are the rest of my guys? Okay, they're doing pretty much the same thing as me. Oh my god, I don't know what happened, but I guess he killed me. <sighs> oh, he's, he's gonna come revive me? Okay. Thank you. I'm surprised, I thought for sure he would just kinda hang out. Damn it, I completely miss. It's just really hard for me to keep the controls right, like when I'm trying to throw the knife. Which is a terrible excuse. Oh no, this is a terrible idea. only there was some way I could get that thing to hit his own, like, people. That is the only way I see this going well for me. And by well, I just mean me not dying. Where'd he go? Oh no. This is actually probably the safest place to be. What's this? Hello. What? <laughs> okay, that didn't feel right. out of ammo for that gun. Shit. Ooh. Oh no. This is not going to go well. Oh, I got so close to killing him. Oh, yes. Okay. Killed the... I killed the captain. That was all me. By myself. Without anyone else. So it's just us against this walker thing now, huh? Oh no, and there's that guy. Now it's just us. I mean, we've made it. Oh god, dang! <laughs> I got blown away. The spider tank. Watch out! What's this guy doing? 
Oh, this is someone different. So I guess the the guy that was playing us with us dropped out. That's kind of lame, but okay. Yeah, drive drive the sparrow into him. Where'd it go? I don't understand what's considered headshotting this thing. Well, not headshotting, but like hitting its weakness. Like that thing? We're getting a lot of 69s. I'm alright with that. It's gotta mean something good, right? Oh my god! Come revive me! Please! I'm right here. Like, right here. No? I mean, if you don't, I don't blame you. Alright, fine. You jerk. You jerk! What was that? I feel like they disabled him for a minute or something. Oh, shit. Someone's dead. I will not be a scumbag, and I'll come get you. I'll be the better man. died <gasps> oh my god <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was safe to go <laughs> that was so dumb this is just a massacre luckily we can just revive I'll be so pissed if everybody dies in this you coming to revive me no all right I guess shooting it in its leg is its weak point. Oh, God! It wasn't looking at me, so I didn't expect that. Oh, no, the captain's back. Where are the rest of the people on my team? that was after me or what, but they missed, so it's okay. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, okay. Knifed him. Oh no. Oh, this thing makes enemies. I didn't notice that until just now. I mean, it doesn't surprise me. What? I don't know how he hit me, but okay. Wait, what? Do we blow up one of his legs? Oh god, someone else died. Please just stay alive for 15 seconds. That's all you have to do. Don't die. Please. Just don't. Okay, now you can die. I, now I don't care.
Oh, one of his legs is messed up now. Oop, okay. I need to jump off that way. here oh god okay all right let's supercharge move him or maybe not because fuck i shouldn't have done this i can't get to his fucking legs oh god what a waste no 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 I'm the only one dead. Watch out. That was close. Wait, maybe that is. I thought it was like Toxic Jack for a minute. I thought it was like XXX Toxic Jack. Maybe I'm wrong. Who cares? Dumb name either way. This fight is taking forever. And now there's just this captain here in the way. Let's just get out of here. I should just run over enemies. Be nice and convenient. Get one of its legs. Hooray. What's that? Oh. I didn't even know about that. Damn it. Well, I guess that's the trick to beating this guy. And we're just now finding it out. Maybe, I mean, maybe that. What? The fuck hit me? Somebody revive me, please. Or just give me 20 seconds, I guess. 
wow, this video is going to be like two hours long. I'm almost sorry. I mean, whatever. If you want to watch the game, if you want to see gameplay footage of this, you'll see gameplay footage of it. I can't really apologize for that. Oh, no. God damn it. Fuck. Oh my god, I'm the only one alive. <laughs> Did I just revive him into like a death sentence? Oh no. No! Wait, will we all still revive? Okay, we all still revive. No! Oh my god. We have to just fight this all over again? The layer is up ahead. Under that colony ship. Just on the other side. I think I'm done. I can't do this anymore. <sighs> like, that was like a solid 40 minutes of fighting that thing. Yeah, I'm done. This is super annoying. Like, this isn't fun for me at all. I mean, like, maybe if I was playing this with other people, like, other, like, friends that I could talk to, it'd be one thing, but, like, this is just boring. Yeah, I'm done. Sorry, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video anyway. I mean, I'll probably keep playing just because I want to know what's going to happen. And if it's something crazy, then I'll show it. But I don't think it will be. And I don't think we'll actually get to it because I'd be surprised if people that I'm playing with right now don't just drop out. I'm going to die right now anyway. Yep. Yeah, guys, I'm done. I can't play this anymore. Did we both die? Oh, no, everyone's alive now. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, well, pretty much all the stuff I said before. Uh, you know, be sure to like the video and comment down below your thoughts on it. And uh, thanks for watching. See you guys next time in the next video.